All right. Doc Positive here. We are here with a couple of the Egyptians. These guys are not Egyptian. You can tell that. But we got <laughs> we got Tut here. And who we got here? Egypt. Egypt, yeah. And they are not Egyptians. They are pit bulls. But King Tut here, he's here today with his mommy. Kiana there, she's shy. She ain't shy, girl. She's, all these women, they don't want to be on YouTube. But I don't care. Because I use it to educate people. Because she came in and she said, uh, this puppy is peeing blood. And I said, God, he's only like how many weeks old? And that's unusual in a puppy. And then, of course, Tut went over and he peed in the corner here. That is Frank blood right there. So, uh, Tut is peeing blood. That's called hematuria. Hematuria, if you break that down, hema is blood, turia is urine. So, King Tut here does have bloody urine. Now, uh, they just got these puppies uh, from the breeder a week ago. And... Uh, King Tut was not peeing blood yesterday, but uh, he did go back to the breeder because a lot of these breeders they do give some of the vaccines. I don't, I, I don't disapprove of that. I don't think that a veterinarian has to give every vaccine, but the breeder gave some vaccines yesterday, and now Tut here, uh, he does have blood at the tip of his penis. So uh, most likely, from the vaccine, it did affect his immune system there. Before so. He took the, uh, Okay, so but what we're going to do is we are going to get uh, Tut going on some antibiotics. Uh, we would normally analyze a urine sample, but that urine sample is so bloody that you're not going to be able to see the forest for the trees, so to speak. It's just going to be all blood. and So uh, we're going to finish our exam with him, check this puppy's temperature, because he's running around, he's squatting and peeing, he's active. So we'll get him going on some antibiotics and get that problem cleared up for these guys. And uh, then uh, they'll probably be back to see Doc Positive, uh, especially after they see themselves on YouTube. Uh, <laughs> all right. Thanks, guys. Uh, all right. Uh, Bye now. Okay, I started shooting that video on King Tut here before we even did our exam. Now that we're examining the puppy, we got the blood over there. One of the things I noticed with uh, Tut here, keep a hand there, Kim, is down here on the toes, he's chewing them. If you see around the base of the toes, that white line, uh, the base of the toes here, there's a line, and that line, we'll sometimes see in puppies, uh, can indicate that the puppy did have uh, an infection or some sort of problem because it, it affects their immune system. And these puppies, as their nails are growing, that line is indicative of a, a problem in their uh, body. So that makes sense here because we got that line real up high near the nail bed base. So uh, what we're going to do here for Kiana and Tut is Doc has some antibiotics here, Clavamox, liquid antibiotics. She's going to start them on antibiotics. And because Tut is active, he's playful. He's checking things out here on the exam table, dog. He weighs eight and a half pounds. His sister over here, she's sacked out, and Dad's worried about her, but uh, she looks good. So we're not going to start her on any medication, uh, but we're going to get uh, Tuck going on some Clavamox. And I told Kiana that uh, that urine should uh, start to clear up over the next day or two, and if not, we'll have them come back and uh, pursue some further diagnostics. All right, bye now.